Aiden Dubley, Amelia Lott, Bailey Schumanns, Hayden Tomlin. Your sophomores are Haley Bishop, uh, Emmy Walsden, uh, Chloe Jordan, Logan Lee, Maylee Miles, Kia Orvin, Megan Smoke, Kamari Thompson, and your freshman is Tana Hall and Lindy Lee Taylor. You might know that Taylor name. Yeah, that Lindy Lee. She keeps that uh, old pirate number 52 straight. Yes, she does. Yeah, uh, she keeps him straight. But well, you know, well, the other one too, Trevor too, also. Well, and Mama, you know who, who's your Mama? Rochelle. No, they got to put up with their daddy. That was the bad. <laughs> yeah, we're talking. Rochelle has taught them kids to play ball and cheerlead very well. I think so too. You That's think so? Rochelle. Slicky had nothing yeah, to do Slicky with. Slicky had nothing to That's do right. with that. Guys, as you can see, is our Appling County Pirate Brigade is taking the field. What a wonderful band that Jonathan Hickox has led here in Appling County for 20 plus years. Love having Jonathan here and what he does with our Pirate Brigade. Uh, guys, I'm telling you, it just it gets my goat every time I get here. I get chill bumps just listening to these kids uh, play. It takes a lot of talent. It does. And at halftime, stay tuned with us in Auburn. Oh, man, we and go check commercial band, free, and you don't hear David out. and I talk. Uh, we know. will be going to the colors here in a few minutes. Yes, um, sir. So. We stay with this, and uh, we, we get up and honor our country and our father. That's and it's right. getting close to that. David's getting close to kickoff time. So we're, we're getting ready and prepared for some exciting football here tonight. How about yourself, David? I'm excited, and now we will be standing in. The colors are being presented tonight by the Abbey County High School Army Junior ROTC.
All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. Uh, after that invocation and uh, Pledge of Allegiance, we got our captains fixing to take the field. David, what All you right. think about it? All after right, you woke we look up across the way there, see Moorhaven. Uh, they're in the white pants, white helmets, white jerseys, and looks like maybe gold or yellow letters and writing and it's going to be kind of hard seeing numbers and all it was last year so we're going to try to do the best we can to keep up with who it is and we're going to see our captains right here maybe you and can I, read some uh numbers from here david i, I know our captains yeah. well uh, go ahead and name ours and i will right, number at, number 11 nehemiah hercules howard uh number 51 that is none other than jockweed's boogeyman van uh let's see here number 19 that is grayson hashtag hall Number 55, that is Jalen the Bulldozer Bennett. And who's that taking up the uh, back end there, David? Big number eight. Big number eight, that is Cameron Mega Man Mobley. And for your uh, Moorhaven Terriers, let's see if we can get some numbers here, David. I think that's number three, Zaylen Jackson. And I can't see no I further can't than see that. It once they start moving a little bit. Yeah, we'll get them called we'll out here, up. folks, at uh, Moorhaven. Here they're making their walk away to meet in the middle of the field, David. Yep, they'll make their turn here in a minute, Chris, and uh, – that's Let's what I was looking for. Like so far, we're getting pretty good crowd here tonight. We do, man. I, I'm glad to see our Pirate faithful to show up uh, for this ball game tonight. They'll make the turn here in just a minute, and maybe I can read some numbers, David. Uh, Let's see here. We're zooming in. Let's see if we can see you. Great job by our cameraman. That's number five, Arian Askew. Number eight, Clarence Hunter. And number 75. Number 75, that is none other than Ryland Sander, senior 6'3", 280. And you can tell uh, it from yeah, here. Yeah, you can tell he's a big youngin' from here. And I got number three, that's Zaylin Jackson. I thought I could see that number a while ago, David. My eyes, I did the same thing as you. I got new spectacles. And uh, I can really tell a difference. <laughs> You're a spectacle, all right. No, I am a spectacle. I know that. <laughs> Listening to me, you can tell that. <laughs> I know. Right. Hey, got to give a big shout out to somebody coming up the steps here if he'll make it. Reed Lovett of Village yep. Pizza, who represents our uh, scoreboard every every night. Number 19, Grayson Hall. And his wonderful, beautiful wife, who keeps him straight. She's got a job. You know what? Mm -hmm. She's got a job trying to keep him straight. She's the brains of that operation. Yep. All right, get ready for. Uh... All right, Pirate fans, it's time to get on your feet. Get ready for one of the best uh, entrances in uh, South Georgia to me, uh, David. That's right. Well, it was all over. Some stuff happened. I think it was showing on Facebook or something. Others wanted to talk, so. Doing good. We're going to look down there, see if we can figure out the toss. And um, Well, here comes the Pirates anyways. Yep, the Pirates are going to go ahead and take the field. And there goes to Cannon. I think the Moorhaven people were ready for that this time. They were, looking, at, they were looking over that way just then. Going to flip. And here comes Moorhaven taking the field. Captains are still at the center. Here come the Moorhaven Terriers. That was the toss. Indication th seems to think that the Terriers won the toss. They did. Right, look, they did. And they deferred. They deferred to the second half. I beat you to that one tonight, David. I'm glad you did. <laughs> I'm glad you did. Chris, I'm actually proud of you, son. Chris, we ate lunch together today and everything, and he was so excited that the results from his IQ test finally come back, and he was excited that everything came back negative. Yes, <laughs> and negative one. <laughs> and I felt so sorry for got a, you. I got a smile out of coal on that one. <laughs> <laughs> felt so sorry for you. Uh, the way you were dressed, I bought your food for you. Well, you were wearing a pink sombrero today, so I'm just saying. <laughs> and I was. I started to wear it here tonight. <laughs> 
I dared you, but you wouldn't do it. <laughs> well, it wouldn't fit my head good. I, I mean, I am the second largest water tower in Appling County. So this is true. This is true. There's not many hats that do All fit right, me, I promise. I do thank Jamie football. at Gardner Printing for making me a hat that does fit. All right, boys and girls, it's time for some Appling County Pirate football here. More Haven Terriers going to kick the ball off to our Pirates. Glad to have you folks down here. Anybody that's joining us uh, all the way down from uh, South Florida, give us a shout out. If you want to give a shout out to one of your young men on the field, let us know. We'll we'll do our best. We sure will. And if we mispronounce the name, folks, we don't mean to. But we got Kamani Riles back deep. And Mikhail Creighton is back deep. Number 14, Wyatt Nicholas. Nicholas. He's a uh, junior, 6'1", 180 pounds, going to be doing the kicking for Moorhaven. Miss Rhonda Smith-Burke was uh, giving us a shout-out. We want to tell you how much we appreciate you. Uh, watch the yep. first segment of it. Uh, we lost power, but we were giving you a big shout-out, and we want to thank you for what you did for us. And, we do and there's kick. It. Oh, onside kick. Oh, and it is covered, looks like, by number 13 for the Pirates. I don't know if that was uh, intentional <laughs> onside or not. He looked like he missed it. Trent Griner got down on the ball, yeah. and it went right through his legs, but he stayed on top of it. So the Pirates will take over around the 47-yard line. You ready for some football? Let's see what I we got. I am. That, that kick kind of surprised me there because I – I can't go the night without talking about last Thursday's game. And I got to give a shout out to our boys. 21 to 7. Yes. 45 total yards they got. That's a shout out for Mr. Bubba Walker. Yes. Great defense. That's right. And his young Bubba men to, defense. to buy into what he sells, and it's a good product. So It sure is. Great job by our Pirates. You know, nothing against those t that team over there, but, you know, it is a crosstown rival, and you know you got to give the kids a shout out when you get it. All right, we got trips to the right, and the backfield is Trent Griner. And Griffiths, the quarterback, takes a snap. He's looking at me. He got a man. That That's is uh, Nehemiah, Nehemiah Howard. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and we did that in sync. I tell you what, I'll hold the base down. You go somewhere in between, okay? Man, it's like oh, boo, 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 Nehemiah Howard. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. We get Cole to join in. We'll get a get another one. We'll get a quartet going here. I like old Nehemiah Howard, a great athlete, great young man. Love all these young men. Hope they have a lot of success here. See big number 45 in the ball game here. Yeah, sure. Looks like he's playing a little bit of tight end out there. Yeah, it does, and he does. Trips That's to the it. left this time. Hands off to Griner. Griner up the middle. Oh dragging a man. Goodness. Brought down by number three. That was number three, Zaylen Jackson. Zaylen Jackson. Tell you what, that Trent Griner, the bull, now I'm telling you, he gets ahead of speed, and you better, you better hold on because he's going had, after it. I got to talk to him before the game started and all um, out in front of the field house. <laughs> he's a good kid. Watch that kid grow up, play rec ball and everything. He's a hard-working young man. He man. really you is. You can tell it. He's, he's talked to me several times. He said, I just want my chance. I just want my chance. I said, it's coming, my friend. It's coming. He, has done, a, he has done a great job. All right, it's first and 10 for the Pirates from around the 37-yard line. Same setup, trips to the left. Oh, we got and a flag. we got a flag. And we got a procedure call on the Pirates. Going to be a five-yard backup. Yep. Not sure who it was on, but. Your back judge called it. We know that, yeah, they, though, don't we? Yeah, we do. That is none other than Bird Lynn. <laughs> they have a good crew out here, David. They, they, usually, they really do. a great do. job here in this community. Glad to have them here tonight. All right, first and 15 for the Pirates. And snap, snap off, hand off to Griner up the oh, middle. Right up the middle. He's going, David. He's got a lane. Got one man to beat. Man grabs him by the. Color. Oh, That's man. Scared. The flag comes out for the horse collar. Pulls him out of bounds around the eight-yard line, but Trent yep. Griner was, wasn't going to be stopped. But Yeah, one some... man got a hand on him, kind of spun him a little bit, but he just kept digging. What a job by your pirate. All you young kids out there just watching oh, man, this, that's see, how you, you keep moving, just moving your feet. Door. We ought to get them on here with us. <laughs> they shook their head. A couple of them. <laughs> Lady Pirate softball players here. Yes, sir. We're proud of our Lady Pirates. One of them's on the home coming court, I believe. Really? I do believe. I'm, I'm not going to name her name. 
She wouldn't say nothing to me. So give me a hug. All right, it's going to make it first and goal for the Pirates from around the five-yard line, David. And I think the call was horse collar. I believe you're right. We got two young ladies here. They want to say something real quick. Yes. Hey, guys. <laughs> Tell them who you are. Um, I'm Olivia Britt. What grade are you in, Olivia? I'm a senior. And what position do you play with the Lady Pirates? Everywhere, but right now I'm at second. There you go. She does a great job. We get to do some of the ball games and all and watch these young ladies, and they are really, really good. What you got upcoming? Um, we have Jeff Davis in Colquitt County tomorrow. And we hope to get them down. There you go. Good job. That's our lady, one of our lady pirates here. Thank y'all. And go pirates. That's, <laughs> I like it. Here, come on. We got another one right here. We got to get this in here. Her mama kill me if we don't get her in here. Hey y'all. Tell them who you are, darling. I'm Riley Tanner. I play first base for the lady pirates. And what grade are you in? I'm a senior. Another senior right here. You excited about tomorrow? Yes, sir. Y'all been working hard, haven't y'all? Yes, sir. Y'all been doing real good. Well, I'm proud of y'all. I'm glad y'all come up here to see us. And thank you. And thank goodness I finally got somebody to put a headset on with mics and all that looks actually are very, very pretty because I have to deal with this clown over here all the time. I'm serious. I, I mean, it's like looking in a toilet or something. I don't know. <laughs> but thank y'all for coming up here, okay? And thank good luck you. tomorrow, girls. Thank you. <laughs> Go Pirates. <laughs> <laughs> All right, David, while the action was going on up here, uh, the action on the field, the Pirates have lost some yards. It's third and uh, goal, but it's third and 14. Griffiths drops back. He's looking to the – well, ball got knocked away. Oh, and the, they call it a and They said it was a forward pass. Morehaven player picked it up and he took off. He had he's twenty yards downfield. Yes, sir. Um, who was that? They're getting some penetration on our they're, offensive they're line. They're big. They're, Look yeah, how big them big kids on are. That defensive line and physical. Better not take them for granted. That's for sure. I'm Looks like our kicker's coming in. Who's that? Alan Ramirez. Ramirez. Got to see his mama today and talk to her. We did. Sweet lady. She always asked if we we're ready for some uh, action. Uh, <laughs> oh, always yeah. ready for pirate action, David. She's proud of that youngin. Don't blame her. All right, this is going to be probably about a 31-yard attempt. 30. There's the kick. It's up. It's good. And it's good. All right, your pirates are on the board. Three to nothing here in the first quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard, 845. Guys, we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. We insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Fans, your Pirates are leading three to nothing here in the first quarter. As, uh, Pirates are going to kick it off here. Look who's back deep, David. I can't read these numbers, my friend. I apologize. Uh, Looks it like is. number 10, Travante Moody. Kick a pooch kick, fair catch called. Caught by number three for them, Zaylin Jackson, around the 30 yard line. Maybe the 28 yard line. I'm sorry. Okay, Chris, I'm going to give a shout-out here. Brittany Heflin says, let's go Terriers. Elena Nicole Alvarez says, go Terriers, number 58. Greg Tillman says, let's go Nephews, number 10 and number 31. Brian Passmore, Edward Ironman Williams, number four. Let's All right. go. All right, Pirate defense. And Jacquez Smith. Right, Pirate defense, defense is on the field. Again, this is a short staff crew from Moorhaven, but they're athletic, and uh, they got some big young men on that offensive line. Oh, so they're we huge. better be prepared for anything. 
They're going to put, uh, looks like, trips out to the right and single to the left. Got to see what we've got coming here. Quarterback takes the snap, hands off one man, and, and we wrap he, him up. About He didn't make it to the line of scrimmage. He may have lost a yard. Nine of the 11 players on, on top of him. Looks like we have motion on the field. Looks like he's going to set him back five yards. I should have brought my binoculars to be able to, uh, to see that. Who's yep. your quarterback tonight, David? That's what I was trying to get. I'm uh, not really sure. If we can get the number, if some of the more Haven people are the ones that are listening it's in. number 15, uh, Takeem Hassler. He's a freshman. He is a freshman. 5'11". He looks taller than that from here. They got enlisted as 5'11". Another handoff over here. Handoff to that and back he's again. Been right and at the line of scrimmage. Red jerseys everywhere. Drive him back. And the first number I see is number four for the Pirates. Ed Iron, Iron Man Williams. By number 45, Edwin Burke. Number eight, Cameron Mobley. And Cameron Mobley in there. And 45 for the Pirates, Edwin Burke. We got to give Mr. Edwin a nickname, don't we? Yeah. He earned that soon enough playing like that. All right, it brings up second and 15 here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. More Haven comes out of the huddle. Well, he got a different running back by here, Zalen Jackson, it looks like. Quarterback takes numbers. snap. He's looking to throw. He's got a little screen over here. Oh, and he's hit immediately by a Grayson hashtag Hall. <laughs> Hall wow. got him time he made the catch. That was number 10 that made the catch. That was Javante Moody. Grayson showing some of that baseball speed. Yep. Like he was going for a grounder there. Well, we talked about Grayson the other day, how he's really come along. I mean, he has really come into his effort football field. He has, and I'm proud of him. Yep. Oh, that's third and about 14 for the Terriers here. It's time to get on your feet and make some noise for these defense. They're around the 24, 25 yard line. Actually, it's the head of the ball is right on the 25 yep. yard line, David. You got two to the right, two to the left on the short side over here. One on back. Quarterback takes a snap. He's dropping back. He's looking, looking. We got, oh, got another flag. On the flag the, comes in. Blue to play I heard a dead. Whistle. Uh, may have a day, delay a game. David, I think the play clock uh, got down on yeah, the Yeah, that quick. may have got him. That's going to back him up even more. Not the, not the position they want to be in, so it's going to make it third and uh, more haven now. Still third down. All right, Pirate fans, it's still third down. Let's get behind this defense. Oh, and he comes around. There's maybe a sack there. Yep. He Looks like him. number five for your Pirates, Darion, the Judge Smith, come around the corner, brother, and just laid him out. And Darion, look who's up coming out of that pile. Number 55. <laughs> five, five, five there. A double nickel, the bulldozer. That's triple nickel if you add them all up. Yeah, that's right. But you couldn't get that far in school, so I know you couldn't count that high school. Hey, I went to school you. over here. I know that, but that was when they were uh, on the other side of town. <laughs> <laughs> they only went to, like, the third grade back then. Oh, is that what it was? Oh, yeah, back, back then. Number three, Camden Hickox. Back to receive the Hickox number 14, back. Wyatt Nicholas is a uh, uh, Nickus. I'm sorry, I don't want to say that. I put the L in there. So I did two a while ago. He is their punter. Punt. Kind of not very far, kind of end over end. Oh, Take nice. a good bounce from bounce. Rolls out to the 45. Probably about a 38, 39 yard uh, punt there. Yep. Pirates are not going to hesitate to get back on the field here, David. Around the 45 yard line. So we're going to stay here with them. Yeah, the Pirates Ball's, are taking the field. Ball spotted on the 45 yard line of the Terrier side of the field. See what the Pirates come out with. Chris, if you can get us some of them offensive linemen, see if you can call some of them out. For us? Yeah. Let's see here. That's number 53. 
Seat number 30 uh, out there. Michael Reed, number 56. That is uh, Jeremiah Riles, number 61. Rhett Stone, number 58. Eight. That is Jared Leggett. And number 30. And number 30 for the Pirates. That is Trent Griner with the ball. He hurdles somebody and gets hit immediately by number three. That's Jackson. Caden uh, Sumner, I believe, is yeah. number 30. Griner going to come out, take him a break, and look who we got coming in. See if I got that right on that number 30, David. Yep, that is Kevin Sumner. That's what I've sure. got on mine, right. too. Yeah. That's right. Just want to make sure I give him a shout-out. Ed Williams coming in for Trent Griner, number Tell four. You what, their defensive line is pretty stout there, isn't it, David? They really are. They're big. I'm going to tell you, that Jackson coming in from that linebacker spot. Good ball players, too. Sure are. There's a snap. Hands off to Williams. She's up the middle. Oh, made two room. or three miss. He's making still on his miss. feet. He's still still dragging people. Wow. Went down to the 25. Iron Man. Wow. He had people grabbing all over, and he kept moving them feet. I think that was about a 20-yard gain. Yep. First down for the Pirates. Yes, sir. Number 11, DeMonta Arthur. That will be enough for another Appley County. Like he run right straight in behind Big 58 and Big 50 there and got him a good push. Staying in the ball game. Hands off to Williams again. The guy come around oh, and he he's still, still on his feet. He's still going. Grabbing and toting and toting. My goodness. Somebody come around. Number one. Adderley come around and hit him in the backfield. Is that number one or is that a number four? Man, he just kept going. They're going to move some personnel in. It could have been a loss, and he made a gain of about oh, five Oh, he hit yards. him the time he got the handoff, and he just – he was Actually, it was six yards is what they give him. Dave. And he snatched loose from him and just kept pushing. Wow. There's some power in those legs. Yes. That was impressive. Pirates are Second ready now. four for the Pirates. Trips to left side, wide side. Let's see what we're going to dial up here. Tell you Griffin's what, with that the ball, short looking, side over there. Screen pass. Oh, he hit immediately after the Cam Hickox, wasn't it? Yes, sir. Missed a block, and he was wide open yep. for the end zone. And uh, I can't really tell who it was coming in and made the tackle. Yeah, I couldn't see the number from here, guys. It's, it's getting darker. He said it was number 10. That is uh, Trevante Moody with a great tackle there. Makes it third and four for the Pirates on around the uh, 18, 19 yard line. Yep. Just got to block that. Oh, we got to run it over here. Ed's still going. And they stand him up right there. They blow the whistle, but he's short of the uh, first down, David. Ed wasn't giving up, was he? We're about a fourth and one there, David. It looks like the offense is still on the field, so yep. it looks like we're going for it. Yep, we're down that fourth down territory right here. Yeah, so what I let's... noticed when we were running trips over to the side, I only see two DBs over there. If we can get a good block out, that would be touchdown. Yep. Still got Ed Williams in the backfield. They're loading the box on us, David. Yep, oh, and they, and they come. Jump. Yep. That, that's the break we were looking for. That hard snap brought them across, so that's going to – should be a pirate. Give us another down. set of downs. False start against Appling County. Oh, they give it on us, David. Yeah, false start. Oh, it was on us. Yes, false sir. start. Sorry, oh, I, I thought we had them to jump. Okay. I did too. It's on the far side to field from us, so we were, we were guessing at that one. Not what the Pirates should have done there. Maybe we can hard count them again and get that five yards. Elena back. Alvarez says her favorite senior is number 58. Ain't that right? Yeah, number 58. Armando Asparaza. Brian Marcy, go Big Red, class of 92 from Tampa, Florida. All right. 
Looks like we're going to uh, bring the field goal unit on David instead. Got to get some of these big scores on there. Yep, on the far hash mark. Snap to hold. The kick oh, is up. Great kick. And nope, he missed it. And the oh, cannon went off. Wide right. Yep. And he missed it. The cannon went off. Yeah, they're getting practice with that cannon, so. Yep. So we miss that. And so Moorhaven will take over right there on the 21. Looked like a good kick from here, David. It just went wide right. It was end over end kick. Great. Had the distance just. Uh, oh, yeah. Plenty of leg there. He was kicking from that far hash and just. The lights. We really need to get some lights. Uh, More Haven. They stack it up tight. Direct snap. He stopped at the line. He's still pushing, though. They got a big push from behind. Oh, wow. They letting it go on, David. Yeah. After the he, stop, they he run the in behind them big guys, and they just they played what we do. They just loaded up and just yes, keep sir. pushing. Come right at us. Felicia Smith said, way to go, number five. Proud of that kid, ain't you? <laughs> Good youngin'. Right, they're lining up in a bunch again, David. Same thing. Same thing. Same thing. He's, He's running this side, side here. He, he got, got running room. room. Trayshawn oh, Moore he... tried and he missed him. Got one more. He's running down the sideline and stepped out somewhere down here. Around the 46, 47 yard line. That's kind of a trick play. Who was that that missed him? Was that? Trying to figure out the number of that young man. That was number one. That's Daquan Adderley. He's a junior, 5'11. What a run by that young man. And they say his weight is 400 pounds. I don't believe that. <laughs> Yeah, we got, we got that one wrong just to miss Q. Yeah, they something – somebody wrote that. Get that out of Max Prep. Yeah, that was Max <laughs> Prep. <laughs> That's why I don't go by those very often, David. That's fastest 400-pounder I've ever seen yes, in my sir. life. First and 10 from the 47-yard line for the Terriers. They're lined back up in this here bunch. Oh, oh they, he fumbles the ball. Pounces yeah. on it. There's a host of Pirates there to get on top of him. I count eight players for the Pirates. Uh, time ticking down in this first quarter. 34 seconds here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Are they going to try and get another playoff, or are they going to take it in to the second quarter yeah, with only like a three-point lead the Pirates have here? Yeah, they've come. I believe they are going to let it go away here, guys. Yep. Looks like we're going to take a break with them, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> Welcome back, Pirate fans. Uh, Moorhaven took this uh, time to go into the second quarter here. Your Pirates leading three to nothing. Uh, they've got first in uh, 20. Or second and 19, I'm sorry. Should be second and 19 for the Terriers because he lost the uh, fumble while ago. That's right. Forgot all about that. Had a man, another low snap. He picks it up. Got a little bit of running room. Pushing forward. Got hey, two. Two tough yards there. Yep. I've seen a lot of movement on that line, David. No call. Yeah. The ball was snapped. But, you know, they see better than we do up here sometimes. Yeah, they're right down there. And I'll tell you, this officiating crew is really, really good. Oh, yeah. Man, is, man, definitely, they're tops. Definitely. Never speak bad about them guys. No. I wouldn't want to do their job, but they need more help at it. So. That's right. Right, You're willing and love the game. Hey, go get certified and go. I they tell you, them. they need officials bad. Yes, sir. They really do. 
All right, it's third and about 15 or 16. Just direct snap, but number one is trying to get oh, around the edge. Oh, he's caught in the Hit backfield for a loss. And number 55. Stopping the backfield. Yep. Your pirate, Jalen Bulldozer Bennett, running down from the backside and made another three-yard loss. Brings up fourth and that, about 20. That fourth and whole, 18. That whole right side collapsed in on him. He didn't have a chance. Back to receive the punt, number three, Camden Hickox. Camden Hickox standing back about the 35. David Sunday, uh, they will be having Go Tell America uh, Crusade here yes. in the Appling County Pirate Field Stadium, Jimmy Swain Stadium. Yep. You will come out and join. This crusade, uh, it's a great thing with Rick Cage. Uh, it starts the 17th on Sunday and ends on the 20th. It starts at 7 p.m. Please come and join uh, this crusade. It's a great uh, it, association. It really is. They had a kickoff the other night, Wednesday night, across the street at Church of God and had over 600 kids. Wow. So this thing is going to be people from all over the place coming here. Come yes, be a part of it. Yes, sir. We don't care what county you're from. Yes, come sir. and join it. Come on. They were here from everywhere the other night. Yes, sir. First and 10 for the Pirates uh, around the 36-yard line. And it would be right here at Jimmy Swain Stadium. Getting some personnel in here for the Terriers. Hey, they've come to play some football tonight. They sure the have. Pirates. This now, is um, Defensively, they're as sound as they can get. Yeah, yeah, and they're quick. They're holding our Pirates. Griffiths takes snap. He drops back looking, looking. They crashing down on him, flushed him out of the pocket. Got a man He's coming over this here. side. He throws off balance. Oh, and a man intercepted. Man, he intercepted around the 50. He waited too long to throw the ball. Had a man wide open down here. And uh, did, couldn't get enough on it. No, and the guy just come across and picked it off, and that was number 10. I believe that 10? was number 50 or 10. I, I couldn't I, tell. I don't know. Couldn't tell. Number 10, that was Trevante Moody for the interception for the Terriers. Got to keep this defense off the field, David. That's not what we wanted to do here. But they, they're a talented bunch of young men here from Florida, let me tell you. Yeah, they've come to play ball. Number 10. All right, Terriers take back over. They got two My split to the gosh, right. Gosh, they're big. They still bring us personnel in. Play clock ticking down to 15. Two backs back here with him. Yep. Number 15 is going to take the snap. There's the snap. He's looking to throw. We, oh, I think we bat it down. We oh, intercepted. intercepted. Trayshawn Moore. Moore. Nobody He's around go him. He's going to all the way. There's nobody in sight. No flags. I don't see anything. Trayshawn, the real deal, Touchdown. Moore. Look at the uh, cannon ring go into the sky. What a job by your Pirates to pay back the interception. Somebody got in there and hit his arm. Touchdown, Pirates. Nobody around him. What a job. I was trying to see who did the uh, hit there. On the tip, the extra point, number 22, Alan Ramirez. Alan Ramirez for the extra makes point. Makes to nothing for your Pirates. Alan Ramirez for the extra point. Hey, getting everybody set. Let's see if we can get the point after right here. Working out the bugs there. It's coming, guys. There's the snap. The hold, the kick is up. Perfect. Right And down it's the good. Ten to nothing for your Pirates. Guys, we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you 
All right, guys, we're back here live. We're having a little issue with the camera, but we're going to get it back here. Just a little bug. Our uh, number one producer is working on it pretty hard right here right now. Uh, they just had to kick off and uh, did a pooch kick. It landed around the 27-yard line uh, where Moorhaven to take over. Moorhaven taking the field. We're going to stay right here with you. All right, defense is ready. All right, Moorhaven has uh, trips to the right. On our side, there's the snap. Hands off to run back. He's coming to our side. He's being chased. Oh, we hit him hard. Nehemiah Howard, I think it was. Actually, that was number 16. 16 Marcus got him. In, that's right. Nehemiah come in and finished him up. They hit him. He got the balls there out to the 30 yard line. We got Cameron. Oh. We are working on it, folks. Y'all just bear with us. I promise we'll be right back with it. We're going to stay live with you. You hear David and I's voice That's for right. a minute. We got a time clock down to four seconds. They're trying to get lined up. Yeah, and I think this is going to be a delay right here. They call it timeout in time. Yep, they got the timeout in time. Guys, we got camera back up. Apologize to you folks at home. Just some glitches happen that we can't control sometimes. But just number one producer, uh, broadcast, well, but producer, I said, uh, got us back up. So we're going to take a break with them, guys, just to make sure we're all good, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get in the back and let's do it. Do it. Welcome back, Pirate fans. It is second and about seven for the Terriers. Your Pirates leading 10 to nothing here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. 9.07 left in the clock. they have got trips to the left and one to the right. David, ba take it over. Ball on the 30. Quarterback takes the snap. Fakes the handoff. Throws in the middle. Got a man oh wide open streaking down there. the middle. We're trying to run him down. We got two or three guys chased him. One's trying to get him, but not in time. Into the I end zone. He touchdown. Scores, David. What a shot. Right across the middle. Yep. Pirates wasn't ready for that one, David. Nah, they hit him, and he just outrun people. Is that number seven for them? I think it might have been number, number two. two. Marquez Durham, what a shot. Wow. Run. Not a pirate in sight for him. He faked the handoff. I mean, a good fake, too. Well, and he just faked the throw, too, on us. Yeah, and just dumped it over the middle with a man streaking right between our defenders. That makes it six to ten right here on your uh, free play, yep, David. He was gone. We Kel didn't have a man to catch him. Well, it takes Drake Snap going for two. He's trying to get around the end. We hit him. Oh, and we but see if he got in. No, Ball he come did not loose. Get in. Nope. Denied by your pirates. Ed Williams makes it a six to ten ball game. Guys, we're gonna take a break and we'll be right. Yeah. They did have the replay there. They did call him short of it. I think his knee went down. So yep. official did call him short. We're going to take a quick break, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in baxley if auto owners make sense for you all right 
welcome back, Pirate fans. Uh, Moorhaven just come off of a score, probably about a 70-yard pass play. Gets him on the board, makes it 6-10. to 10. Pirates leading here. Very athletic team here, David. Sure are. They very uh, better not sleep on them. I've said that before, but they've got some athletes. There's the kick, low, long kick, bounces, picked up my, by Mikael Creighton. This kid here's excitement. See what happens, but he's met at the 30 by two got a Terry. Flag on this play here in the backfield. Maybe a holding call on the Pirates. And I think it is going to be on the Pirates. They may be short staffed, but they got some athletes there to play. They, they really do. And these kids, my. They're playing a little bit of Iron Man football, well, too. Well, they're big and they're quick. Yes, sir. All right, Pirates lead 10-6. to They're going to take over. Ball's going to be spotted around the probably. Holding on the return. Back it up to a point about the 15, line. yeah. Yeah, it's holding on the return team there. Got to do away with those penalties. This is time to not have yeah, penalties. That's... There's uh, 8.49 on the clock here in the second quarter. The Pirates are coming out with uh, two to the left, one to the right. We're getting ready to go here. Play clock ticking down, 10 seconds. Who we got in the backfield? That's Griner again, ain't it? It is Griner. Snap. Hands off to Griner right up the oh, middle. He's got room, Dave. He's got one to oh, miss. He's, he's got, got to pass him. He's a couple got of them trying to, to run him down. down. He's at the 50. Tackled down around the 53. That's where they should have been. Going to mark him at the 54. That's almost a 40-yard run. <laughs> you did the 54 this time, didn't you? I tried to tell you. I've been waiting on you. I told you I was going to do it, too, didn't I? You did. That'll be enough. All right, first down, Pirates. Ball's at the 46. Trenton Griner, the bull, showing us a little bit of that speed there, David. He is, but my goodness. They were running a couple of them guys with the white yeah. shirts. Just yeah, run him down. The hole they give him was great. Oh, yeah. All right, it's first and 10 from around the 46-yard line. Griner still in the ball game. Ball on the 46. Man in motion. Oh. And we jump. So that's a false start. And that's going to be the one step forward and 10 steps back. No, it's going to back us up. Five steps back. Tamika Shinholsters. It's good to see you. Y'all better do it, Pirates. Tiana Williams, let's go, Terrors. Got to get our Pirate fans up on their feet and not in their seats. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> they feed off the crowd, David, and that's what we need. Sure do. First and 15 for the Pirates around the 49-yard line. There's a snap to hand off to Griner. And he's... He's tackled. He almost got back to the line of scrimmage. Maybe a three-yard gain there for yeah, Trent. It is. He got three of them back. You know, the best direction at a small team like this is playing both ways is to run the ball. Yeah. You know, that's what you wear them down. Let's see what kind of uh, physicality you got. Yep. So far, these young men are showing everything they've got from more I, even. I, I, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed I, by these I, young I'm men. I'm impressed. I yes, mean, sir. well, we were we were last year. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Had a we quality were. team last year. Yeah. Long trip to come up here and, and play a team from Georgia, especially South Georgia. Yeah. And they Second come from and South Florida. For the Pirates. Snap. Hand off to Griner. Oh, he's got, got a little runner. He's got first down. He's still on his feet. He can go feet. all the way. He is. He put in the Jets, and the Bull is in for a touchdown, Pirates. Trent Griner, the Bull, come off and bounced off about two defenders and just made it to the end zone. Would not be denied. What should have been a one-yard gain ended up with a touchdown. Yes, I sir. Like that. What a job. 51 yards. Excuse me. That's 48-yard touchdown by Trent Griner. Seen Seth Taylor walking up and counting folks. Uh, yeah, he, he might be counting you. He's counting heads over here. I don't know what he's looking at. <laughs> All right, Ramirez to try the extra point. Snap to hold the kick is up and is good. Right down the middle, your Pirates lead 17 to 6 here in the second quarter, 7.03 on the clock. We'll be right back, guys, for some Pirate action.
Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today. All right, guys, we're back. Kicks off for Allen. Ramirez has a pooch kick. Man's taking the sideline over there. Oh, he's shoestring tackled over there. He had a lane over there. He could have took off, David. Yeah, he was trying. He um, Great job by our pyres. But Moorhaven, I'm telling you, man, I'm not going to down these young men. They no. have got a quality team here. Yes, well-coached team, well-disciplined team. Bubba Leggett watching from Atkins, Arkansas. Man, glad to have you here with us, brother. Got Aaron and Mary Ann Williamson from Denton, Georgia. Clay Sharp is watching us tonight. Hey, Clay. He's in service with Gaz Harnett tonight. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the Pirate defense is taking the field. Looks like Moorhaven's running some kids back on here. Pirates lead 17-6. to Moorhaven knows that we can score real quick. Going to have to watch that up the middle. There's the handoff. If we hit him, he pushed forward one gain of about one yard. Yeah, tough yard. Our Pirate defense – David. I think that's the most yards I've seen them give up in a few games, David. That's right. David Rooks is with us tonight. Daryl Shaw. That was a hard one-yard run, too, for that young man. Getting the play in over here. 17 seconds on the clock. Play clock. 6.20 on our clock. Getting lined up, getting the call in. Yeah, Moorhaven up to the line. Might see another one of these down the middle plays. Ooh, that was scary. They got the Snap. speed for it. He does. Those little does. screen pass. He got a man over, one or two to beat. Good tackle over there by number yeah. two for the buyers. Gain Mike of Hill about Crane. five, maybe. Yes, sir. Great uh, throw and catch. Hadn't called Mikel's name a whole lot here lately, David. I been kind of quiet on him. He's such a good defender. You don't see a whole lot of folks throw it his way. I'm telling you, he's exciting, though. He I love watching him carry the man. ball. Man, he's exciting. Speed-wise, he reminds me a lot of Devin Moore. Yes. Ron Moore. Yes. yes. All right, third and four, or third and five for the Terriers. A long five. There's a snap, handoff to that big running back. Better get in there with the They're pushing. defense. They let him down on the ground. Little to no gain. Getting up off the pile was see who that is. Ed no. Williams. Hey, no, sir. And number That's 51 was in there. Yes, sir. Jaquez Boogeyman Van. I don't have a whole lot of favorites, but I, I, if I did, Jaquez would be one of them. <laughs> That's right. Not just a friendly young man, except when he's on that football field. Yep. <laughs> I like I love all these pirates, but you know, I get to talk to some of these young men on a on the brim, you know, when they're coming through. Yep. And he never fails to say, "Hey, to, hey, Mr. Chris." So he's I he's nice. That. All these kids, man, oh, they're so like polite. They're going for it, David. Fourth and three. Yep. And they, they got us to. Draw us off. I think they did it. They did. They threw the flag. Yep. Maybe on them. It may be on no, them. They call it on us. Yep, they called it on us. They and that's going to be a first down. They played a us on us. They did. Well, that's going to give the Terriers a first Which, down. You know, you can't get across that neutral zone. And, you on know, you've seen a lot of Well, we had like three guys jump. Well, they did too. They had one move and come back. But, you yep. know, it's – Last one they saw, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's. It's first and ten for them. Fires has got to hold them again or get a takeaway here. There's a handoff. The back's coming to this side. Oh, There's a flag coming in from the back side. Oh, and the ball comes loose. But, but there's a uh, whistle call before that. Yep. Holding. Holding on Moorhaven. They are going to take the penalty. He's going to back them up 10 yards. Makes it first and 20 for the Terriers. Tell you what, though, David, I, I look down on this way, and I'm seeing some numbers. Uh, Lawrence Wright, number four, I uh, see. That's correct still. 
Just some good looking athletes. Number 12 in here, Aiden Thomas. Mm -hmm. Playing receiver. Number six, just uh, Justin Hernandez. Quarterback's pretty pretty sound back here tonight. Sure. Number 14. Is. Freshman. Takes the direct snap. He's looking for some running room, and we stack him up. Maybe a line of scrimmage. That was number one, Daquan Adderley. Was that who it there. was? Okay. Yeah, that 400-pound man they got listed. Yeah. Here. <laughs> He'll be tickled to hear that. Yeah. We got I, that off of Max Prep. So guys, yeah, that's what joking. they got on there. This young man is nowhere near 400 pounds, but he no. runs like he he is a good runner for Moorhaven. Kick it fly. You folks down in Moorhaven, I want to tell you, you got a you got an excellent coaching staff. Uh, Jack Garrett's. Uh, Really a, a great gentleman uh, once you get to talk to him and all. I've, I've enjoyed, you know, keeping up with him throughout the year and last year. Heck of a ball team, heck of a coach, and, you know, I see great things happening for this team. Yeah. Guys, we're taking a break with them. They're taking the time out. More Haven is, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Welcome back, Pyre fans. It's second and 20 from around the 33-yard line from Moorhaven. They're going to snap the ball and take a direct snap. Yep, he's going around he's that left side. He, and oh, we, we tripped did. him up. Number 15, Trayshawn, Trayshawn Moore. Moore. Not before he gains Not about 10 yards. Well, they Trayshawn blocking Moore. in, uh, and they're getting the edges on us. We're going to have tell to you, he had, Man, he quick. And that's what you got to watch for there, David, at any point. That's right. James Orvin, class of 02. Brianna Harrington's with us. Yeah, I about got where I can't keep up with Steve it. Steve Crowder right, checking in from Eufaula, Alabama. That's right, good fishing there. Third down and nine for the Terriers, David. See if the Pirates can hold them here. There's 316 here in the second quarter. Your Pirates leading 17 to six here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Direct snap. He's trying to get around this side here. We, oh, and he's we, caught we hit him. quick by number 16. Jamarcus Robinson and, and number Burt was in there. Edwin Burt. Williams was in there too. Looks like they give him a game. Uh, the game back to the line of scrimmage here, David. Yep. I thought he may have lost a yard, but they give him right back to the line of scrimmage. See what the Pirates can do here. Back deep for the Pirates, number three, Kevin Hittox. Maybe the Pirates can uh, block this punt or something, David. What you think? Got Camden yeah, let's Hickox. see if we're going to go after him right here. Got Camden Hickox back here deep. We're threatening like we might come. We sent a couple in. No. Oh, we had a man there quick. That could have been pretty deadly there. False start by Moorhaven. Nehemiah was about to grab that ball and take it to the house. It sure was. It's going to bring up fourth and about 13, 14 for the Terriers. Blake Cock reset at 25, so they got plenty of time here. Got to watch your gunners. You got to block them off if you let the ball go. Looks like the Pirates may be going after it again, David. Yep, what you think? Looks like they are. They're lined up like we're going after. 
We might have seen something here, a crease that might get us. Nope, he gets the ball off. High end over end. Oh, and it gets a good terrier bounce, David. Sure did. But it's down around the 35-yard lines where the pair, where the Pirates will take off. <laughs> where the, the Pirates. <laughs> yeah, what? Well, Pirates have Pirates. They, they do. do. That's they right. Do. I'm with you. I'm with you, brother. Go ahead. My tongue got tungled. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> They are discombobulated, as we always like to say, David. I ain't a very smart man. <laughs> well, I never have been. All right, the Pirates get back on the field real quick here. It's first and 10 for the Pirates on the 36-yard line. One of my uh, – Michael Miles checking in, Levi Miles checking in from Vilsack, Germany. Hey, wow. I'm, I was born in Berlin. I'm an Army brat, though, or just a brat. <laughs> <laughs> He's definitely a brat. <laughs> All right, first and ten. I'm not sure what was going on there. They blew the whistle, but they blow it back to start the game up. Fire's taking over here. Let's see what the offense can do. There's a snap. Griffiths dropped back, looking, looking, looking. Oh, Throws he's going deep. deep. Throwing, going after Eccles. Eccles goes up. Oh, Eccles got it. Catch. That is a catch for the Pirates. It always goes the Pirates, the yep. offense's way, not the defense. Yep. So the Pirates have a great game. From Kellen Eccles. Number 10, Moody for Moorhaven was right there, too. He had a hand in on the ball, and what I'll tell you. throw by Dason Griffiths, a dart. Yes. But I want to say this to this young man down here from Moorhaven, folks. He was dead on, Keelan. He, he was with him. Yes, sir. But it always goes your offensive way, not your defensive way. Well, guys, they're taking a timeout. I think it's an official timeout. Well, we're going to stay with them. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back. Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get to Baxley and let's do it. Do it. Welcome back, Pirate fans. It is first and 10 from the 25-yard line. David, take it away. All right, Trent Griner, right back there with Griffiths. Griffiths takes the snap. He drops back. He's looking. He throws one up in the corner over there. Who we got? Cam Hickox. Touchdown, Touchdown. Pirates. What a toss by Dason to Camden Code Red Hickox in the corner of the end zone for a touchdown. 23 to 6, your Pirates lead. Look at the replay Man. here, David. There he is. Takes the snap, drops two steps back, just throws it up. Cam Hickox with that state champion speed. And the dart from Dason. Man. Wow. Ramirez to try the extra point. Snap to hold. The kick is up. And it's good. All right, 24 to 6. Folks, we apologize about the flicker, and they are working on it pretty heavy. We're going to take a break with the Pirates. They lead 24 to 6 here in the second quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard, 24 to 6. We'll be right back with some Pirate action. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in baxley if auto owners make sense for you Pirate 
Wildfire fans, we're back. Alan Ramirez with the kick. Push kick, fields it about the 15. Oh, and falls he slips. down. And they're going to call him down right there. He slipped yeah, his knee, knee hit. His knee hit. Folks, your Pirates are leading 24-6 to six here in the second quarter with a great throw and catch. Uh, Dason with the throw and Camden Hickox with the, the reception yeah. there in the end zone. Big a strike. quick, like a 20-second uh, <laughs> play. Yeah, that was, that was, that was nice Two to plays see. and a touchdown for the Pirates. So we know they can execute quick plays. Uh, yeah. That's something good to see by your Pirates. So Moorhaven's going to take over on the 15-yard line. But we can't let up this Moorhaven team, I tell you. We've, we've seen a lot of flash out yes, of Yes, sir. It. Quick throw and catch and a touchdown just real quick like. So you got to be prepared for anything. Yeah. Say hello to John Skipper, Haley Gleaton. Hey, Daryl Hawkins says go Pirates. Oh, Daryl. Moorhaven with the snap. Hands it off to the running back. He's looking for running room. We hit him, sling him forward. A lot of aggressiveness down there on that field between both teams. But I tell you, this is a sizable Moorhaven team. And give them three on that. Man, if you you had some good backups with these young men down there from Florida, I'm telling you, it'd be something else to see. Man. 52 good. seconds here on the clock. Looks like we got a timeout here by Moorhaven. We're going to take a break with them, guys. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. It's second and seven for the Terriers. Take it away, David. There's a snap. Looking screen pass over here. You hit a man. He's got a little bit of running room. We oh, hit him. Oh, what a hit. And Nehemiah Howard, I think it was, grabbed a hold of him. And Grayson Hall. Grayson comes, Hall come in and finished him up. He said, wait a minute. Here I come. Looks like another timeout called here by Moorhaven. Or maybe it been the Pirates. I didn't see who where it was directed to. The pillar yeah, was in I my think, way. Yeah, um, I official pointed towards the Pirate. For the Pirates? Bench. Took the, okay. I figured you could see it because this pillar was in my way. I can't yeah, see nothing. Gaz's pillar. Yeah, Gaz's pillar, the column, is right in my way. We're going to stay here with you, folks. It's about 50, no, 45 seconds left here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. And as you see, Appling County is leading 24 to 6. They're taking the field now. Moorhaven out here with that big offensive front. All right, Pirate fans, it's third down. Good gracious, they're huge. They look nice like a college team pull, come <laughs> up to the line. I ain't kidding. These guys are All right, huge. third and seven for Moorhaven. Let's see what they got in store Red here. Snap. Hand off. Hand off oh, right up the middle. He's room. got running room. He oh, made one he miss. Cuts. Treshawn Moore come over and hit him. Jalen Bennett come around. What a run by number three, Jalen Jackson. And that's a first down. Just talked about that offensive line. They're going to take a timeout here, David. I believe we're going to take it with them. Cole, we'll be right back with some pirate action. Oh, I'm sorry, the replay there. I apologize. There you go. I was lost in translation over here. Yeah. He's Cole, it's my fault, buddy. <laughs> All right, we're going to take a timeout with them. We'll be right back, pirate fans. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705 2273 and let us help you stay healthy. All right, 
Welcome back, Pirate fans. Their first down here for the Terriers. Take it away, David. All right, there's the snap. He looked like he was going to hand off. He throws it up the middle. There's his man. Oh, and, and he stays him, on his we feet. We didn't wrap him up. He's still on his feet. He's at the 20. And he's caught from behind by number two for the – no, number 11. Number Nehemiah Howard. Nehemiah Howard. Man, I thought that was going to be a collision. What a catch by that young man. Number seven. There's the replay right there. Frank Moody or Moody. List is – they're playing fast. The clock's ticking. They yeah, spike it. They the have ball, no more the timeouts. It's 20 seconds left on the clock. There is no timeouts, but they do have to get the play that clock. end zone. They're trying to get so they can score for this half. Right up the middle on us, David, is what's been killing us tonight. That is. That young man, man, catching the ball like that with that that man coming at you, that's something else. Well, we hit him and just he just spin off yeah, our he guy. He held onto the ball and took off. And Nehemiah Howard had to run him down. And this big offensive front they have is just wreaking havoc up there. They are, brother. Better be prepared for anything with number seven there. Quarterback, one back in the backfield. Takes a snap. He He's looking the to throw. Again. He had trips over there. He throws it to the corner, but we got somebody Oh, it's somebody intercepted. There. Who is that? I think it's Treshawn Moore. I is think it Treshawn Moore again? He's got He's a running lane. Line. He could go. He's got a block or He two. could go all the way. He is all the way. Treshawn, real deal Moore with an interception, a 100-yard <laughs> interception. <laughs> what a job by your Pirates. Wow. Wow, Pirate fans, if you're not on your feet now, you are not a true Pirate fan. What some blocking down that line, Look too. at the replay, David. He throws, throws it, it up. So he catches it and, and just comes out the end zone, stutter steps. Look at the blocking all down the line there. Well, I'm not going to take from him because that's 105 yards from where he caught that that's ball it. at. Nothing but a running lane for Trey Sean Moore. 30 to 6, your Pirates lead here in the second quarter. Allen, the Razor Ramirez, to get the extra point. One second on the clock, David. Dason Griffiths to hold. There's a snap. The hold, the kick is up, and it's good. All right, your Pirates lead 31 to 6 here in the second quarter. We're going to take a break, guys, and there's one second left on this clock, so we'll be right back with some pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if Auto Owners make sense for you. That's what he was supposed to say. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Welcome back, Pirate fans. Another pooch kick over here. Just mishandled oh, he by a player. It. Oh, and can we get on it? And we got him in the play clock ends for the and Pirates leading. The half. 31 to 6 here at halftime here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Guys, we're going to stay here with you just a minute. One of the young men from the track uh, team uh, just made it here to – to get his ring, and we want to make sure we recognize everybody. We did say his name, but he just got here. So we want to make sure he gets his accolades and gets his ring. That's and right. Got to give a big shout-out to Will, too. This is Will Solomon for the Pirates. Playing a little bit of college football right now. That's right. As we take this opportunity to recognize the fourth member of the boys' 4 by 400 relay team, who made the trip from Barry College down here tonight. Where he's yeah, he's at Barry College now, uh, David. He's part of the back-to-back -back championship. Yep. Uh, he was the four by 200 state champions. No, excuse me, four by 400 back-to-back -back champions, Will, William Solomon. Yep. Uh, also a school record. 
Uh, William almost uh, all all excuse me. I'm gonna get it out. Also was seventh in the 400 meter dash in individual. So very proud of William and very proud of his accolades and playing ball at the next level. Yes, sir, playing at the next level. It don't matter if it's NIAI Junior College. Uh, D3, D2, D1. That's right. Um, and I'm going to give a huge shout-out to somebody real quick, Cole, before we go take a break uh, and give it to the Pirate Brigade. You won't do it because I need to do this. Go Ty ahead. Benton, I'm proud of you, young man. <laughs> he made the varsity th- th- uh, yesterday. He got the news, and he's traveling to tomorrow to play. No, he traveled today. Yeah, he was traveling today, but they're playing tomorrow. Just want to give him a big yep. shout-out and tell him how I'm proud of yep. him. You know, hard work and – and getting through adversity and keep playing. That's, that, it shows you that's that what should. goes. So, guys, we're going to take it to the field. Commercial break free about your uh, Pirate Brigade, one of the best bands in the land. As we always say, go Pirates. They're led by none other than uh, Sydney Kate Ropey, the drum major. Your band captains are Chloe Boatwright, Woodwinds, Trinity Doyson on the brass, and uh, Avery Turney on the percussions. There's a young lady. Uh, get a talk about Miss Susan Carter uh, is going to be committed to Ole Miss for air rifle team. David, I want to give her a big oh, wow. shout out. Her David, to, uh, her daddy Daniel told me today about her commitment. Very proud of that young lady. So, uh, uh, just wish her all the best. All right, guys, here it is, Pirate Brigade taking it over the field. Let's give them a big shout out and go Pirates. The 1960s saw a cold war between the two superpowers of the world, the United States and the Soviet Union. These two nations competed for superiority in technology, science, and space travel. This essentially ended with the landing of men on the moon by the United States in 1969. History now defines these events as the space race. I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the earth.
Houston uh, and Guardi Base here. The Eagle has landed.
your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, Family Nurse Practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, Family Nurse Practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 
2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. We're going to start the second half off here with the Pirates kicking off to Moorhaven. The Pirates leading here 31-6. to six. Starting the third quarter here on your Village Pizza scoreboard, Allen Ramirez with the kick. It's a deep, long kick over here to the left side. Trying Field to catch him off guard. Around three or four. Oh, we get a Pirate slip in he there, but a over. host of Pirates Man. in there to stop him. He got hit hard at the 10. Number 21 for your Pirates. That's Darion Hood. Wow, what a what lick. What a lick in there. We're glad y'all are back with us for the second half. Yes, sir. Uh, Let's see them numbers pop up. Give us a comment. Let us know how we're doing here Pat for the Pirate Faithful. Pat McLean said, wonderful performance band. Thanks for your dedication. It was a wonderful performance. And I tell you, their dedication is unreal. The practice they put in, man, a lot of hours. Got to give a shout-out to Jonathan uh, Hickox and uh, – John Beck uh, with the drum line now. Mm -hmm. Percussion, he's doing an awesome job. Just come home to be with the Pirates. Pirate defense here trying to stop this uh, More athletic with the snap. team Hands to that running back. He's dragging people and still Man. on his feet. Gain of about five. That was 55. Maybe more. Jalen Bennett, the bulldozer, gets off his block and grabs him by his knees. Not before he gains about six to yeah. seven hard yards there, David. That number three for them, uh, Zaylin Jackson is a bear now, I'm telling you. He is. We had people wrapped around him, and he Man. was still kicking. Shows him his 5'8", 209. I'm going to tell you what, that young man's got some legs on him. Yeah, he's, um, he's a good athlete. All right, it's second and four for the Terriers. More Haven, more haven takes to. Uh, you were going back the way Kim, uh, Cole spelled it, More Heaven? Yeah, More Heaven. <laughs> <laughs> Another handoff there, David, and the Pirates. So they uh, that left side, and we stack him up, but they're still pushing. They're that. still pushing on us. Might give him enough for a first down there. He's real close. Yep, that's a first down. 
He just they just stacked up and run behind that big Man. offensive line. Playing some old man football there, as they call it. <laughs> Brings up first and ten for the Terriers from the 23-yard line. Tell you what, it's, it's funny to see you have both the receivers uh, along with the quarterback over there by their coach getting the play. No signals coming in. It's all, you know, by mouth. Yeah. More Haven's going to bring two to the left, two to the right. Yeah, they're spreading us out a little bit. One back in the backfield with the quarterback, oh. and they're going to call timeout, timeout by the Terriers. All right, folks, we're going to take a break with you. Your Pirates lead 31-6 to six here in the third quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Pirate fans, first and ten for the Terriers. David, take it away. All right. Quarterback with the snap, hands off that running back. He runs into his own man, but he still bounces off. He's still on his feet, spinning around trying to get loose, and he did. We got to hold on. Him. But he's not giving up. He run for 15 minutes bouncing off of people man, and still I, gained two or three yards. If I could give that young man a nickname, it'd be the Bear. The Bear. That that's young him. man runs with everything he's got. Yeah, gracious. Scratching and clawing, he never give up. And that's a great job by uh, Zaylin Jackson for the Terriers. Yeah, Moorhaven, uh, we, we, we're bad about giving our players nicknames <laughs> up here. <laughs> so, All right, makes it yeah. second and seven for Terriers. Three to the right, one to the left. Waiting on the snap. Snaps snap. up. Hands off the running back. Right up he's to the middle. Room. Running behind them big still guys still pushing. on his feet. And our Pirates are He's not close to a first down, Chris. Yes, sir. We're going to wrap him ankles up and bring him to the ground. If not, this young man's going to first down us to death on this and he drive. Got, he got a first down. It is a first down for the Terriers. If you'll see what's happening, he's running up there and we're hitting him and he's getting behind them big guys and it's just such a no, massive those, push. There and his legs are still turning, David. Oh, yeah. That's a lot of power in those legs. Trips to the right. There's hey, the handoff. He's looking at left side, that short side. Yes, sir. We had somebody grab him. That was Ed Williams. Keep flag feeding the bear. come in from backside. I think that was a flag come in, wasn't it? You know, they tell you, they tell you in the, uh, the forest not to feed the bears and they feeding that bear. Yep. It's going to be holding on Moorhaven. First mistake of this half for them, David. That's negated a, probably a three or four yard gain, a hard run for, for uh, Jackson there. MJ, MGM, number one, my blood cousin. Going to make it first and 20. Chris is going to bring trips out to the right side. Trying to spread us out. Oh, There's and we get him in the backfield. Number 11 for your Pirates comes stringing in there. To Nehemiah <laughs> and Hercules Howard said, <laughs> no more. We're Ed, not. We, then Ed Williams wrapped him up. Well, Iron Man come in there and backed him up. And then Cameron Mobley come in for that linebacker Ooh, spot. Mega Man. They're tired of that running up the middle on us. Capitalizing for another about a five yards. Going to make it second and more heaven. Not more heaven. <laughs> Cole giving him that look. <laughs> love you, Cole. I don't get much on my brother Cole. I can tell you that. I love that young man. You don't get too many things for him. 
All right, it's second and about 24 yards for the Terriers. And Looks like another timeout by timeout. the Terriers. Going to take away their two of their timeouts. We're going to take a break with them, guys. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get to Baxley and let's do it. Do it. Welcome back, Pirate fans. The ball's been snapped. It looks like he's going to go pass. for another slant. He got a man coming across the middle with a gain of about seven. That was number five with the catch. Aaron Askew, a sophomore, 6'3", 199 for them. Great catch and throw. Gain of about uh, maybe 10 yards there, David. Brings up third and 15. Uh-huh. A little bit more manageable for the Terriers. Third and 16 is what they've got it listed on the scoreboard. All right, Pirate fans, get on your feet and make some noise. It's third down. All right, third and 16 for the Terriers. They've got to spread out wide again, David. That's shorter. Hand off in the middle. Back. We got hands on away. him, but he bounced off. We're chasing him. Oh, and we get a good tackle by none other than number 19, Grayson Hashtag Hall. Wraps his leg up, not before he gains about six yards there, David. Yep. What a shot and what a what a good play. Sure was. Good call by the Moorhaven team. Man, trying I to tell you, he's, we hit him and we got him, and he's just right here. You can see it. He just gets loose. That was number one, Daquan Adderley, Jr., I want to say to those folks that come uh, all the way from Moorhaven, Florida, up tonight, uh, glad y'all folks come to visit. Yes. I uh, hope you enjoy our small town here in Applin County. i uh, love to have you folks visit any time. Come see us. Looks like Moorhaven is lining up to punt the ball. Who is this back deep punting, David? That is none other than Cam Code Red Hickox. Low, wobbly kick, bounces. Hickox picks it up. He's got a little run and oh, run around goodness. that edge. Oh, he's hit out of bounds over there. Whew. And we got another flag on the field. Maybe a holding. Yeah, that's what it looks like from That's that in area. the vicinity of a holding call yep. there, David. Sure is. Actually, two to three flags on the ground. A lot of laundry. A lot of laundry. Going to ne- probably negate probably about a 15-yard gain there for the Pirates. Not sure. Is that it is called? On the Pirates. Yep, and they're going to back us up. Going to be spotted around the 31-yard line for the Pirates. Okay, we got Jakari Kinsey in the ball game now. Kellen Eccles over to this side. Cam Haycox on the short side by himself. Trent Griner in the backfield. You just joining the Pirates are leading 31-6 in the third quarter, 5.53 on the clock. Well, he even took a lot of time off the clock with that series. Yep. There's a snap. Hands off to Griner. People grabbing him. Lunges forward. Got a helmet off on the field. And that's Kinsey's helmet, I think. He's going to come off a play. Right, gain of two yards. Looks like they're spreading out a little bit on that defense now. You know, they were bunching up on us earlier, David. Mm-hmm. Be a good time to take a few shots. We Down might. the field, you reckon? Oh, yeah. See what we can dial in here, because we definitely ain't got enough score on the board. Not with this team. No, sir. They showed they can score just as quick as we can. All right, they're lining up, getting set for the Pirates. They're loading the box up again, David. There's a snap. Griffiths looks. He drops back. Got a man re- tried to grab a hold of him. He's going to take it and run. He's running for the sideline. 
Runs out of bound at the 41. Griffiths on the quarterback keeper. Did he get enough of a first down, David? He's right at it. Got a man down, guys. We're going to take a break. I uh, think he may have got it, Chris. I think he did get a. I think they may give him the first down there. Yeah, I think he got it by a yard. Well, guys, we're see. going to take a break uh, with this uh, injury. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. down for the Pirates guys we're welcome back uh Pirates taking over with the first down that was White and the kiss uh the injury but he walked off on his own thank the lord hands He's off the okay. Williams was in the backfield and got wrapped up real quick by number one yeah that number one Daquan Adderley these guys are playing a little bit of Ironman football against these Pirates and there's some athletes on this field David I'm telling you from, well we were Warhaven. we were sitting there talking earlier off air about how these guys, you know, not a lot of numbers and all, and they're playing both sides of the ball, and they don't seem gassed at all, do they? No, not at all, buddy. I mean, not at all. I want to give a big shout-out to Caleb uh, Robinson stepping up on the offensive line tonight. <laughs> Got a few injuries there. Praying for those young men to be able to come back. Looks like they're going after a – There's a snap. Throw across the middle, Kellen Eccles, who gets oh, the ball and great. tackled immediately, but that's going to be a first down. That's going to be a gain of about 10 yards for Kellen Eccles. Hadn't heard his name a whole lot tonight, but Kellen's a force to be reckoned with on that field, David. Great play. First down, Pirates on the 45-yard line. They're moving the ball. First down. Play clock ticking down. We're looking to the sideline, waiting on the play to come in. Sorry, folks. I had to wake David up over here. <laughs> no, Chris stopped on me looking at me. I was looking at the corner of my eye, and I'm like, hey, Yeah, you were asleep, old oh, man. I wasn't asleep. <laughs> First and ten for the Pirates. Griffin Stepping back. back. Oh, looking. he's oh, got man. a man on his backside. Got hit hard from behind. Was that number three for them? Yeah, it looked like it. Zaylin Jackson. Is that what he's wearing? Is that three? I can't no, it's tell. Number five, I believe. Five? Is it five? They're in the skew. It's number eight. Number eight. I'm sorry. I really messed that one. Clarence Hunter, 6'2", sophomore for them. Clarence, that was a big loss for the Clarence Pirates. Clarence the bounty hunter. Man. <laughs> man, he come in there and just. He did, man. Great job by him. He blew around that he end. come off that end. Yeah. Knocks us back about 12 yards, 10 yards. And we got to play in now. Play clock ticking down to two, one. I don't think – did we get it off in time? I guess so. Side oh, arm getting hit. Oh, he's got room, David. Oh, he's Man. shoestring tackled over there. And Griffiths got hit as he was releasing. By the time he got hit, he had to throw a side arm like he was turning a double play. Hey, he got it off just in time, but it still makes it third and about 13 for the Pirates. Yep. Got hit hard. That's back-to-back -back plays that Griffiths has gotten hit. They're they bringing the house on us too, David. Yeah, they are. Not a shabby team whatsoever. <laughs> this is actually one of the better teams we played, I think. Defensively, they have been all over us tonight. Mm -hmm. Third 
Griner in the backfield with Griffiths. Trips to the left. And snap. Hands off to Griner. He had a little run room. Dove forward. Trenton Griner with a, probably about a four-yard gain is going to bring yeah. up fourth and uh, maybe nine. Mm -hmm. Not sure what the Pirates are going to do. They think they're going to let some clock run off, maybe kick the ball. Yeah. Well, yeah, I, don't clock. Think, I, yeah. think, I don't think we're going to do anything crazy right here, not with this team. No, sir. Pin them back and hope for the best. Who you got back deep here for them, David? Can you read that number from I, here? I can't. I didn't I, think so. I can't. <laughs> I can't either. That's why I was relying on your old eyes. Number 10, I did see uh, Trevante Moody and DeMont DeMonte uh, Arthur are back. Both sophomores for them. Griffiths to punt the ball. Punch. Oh, nice. Ah, wobbly. Bounce. Oh, and it gets Great a pirate bounce. bounce. It's going to roll oh, down. Oh, and he and grabs it up, up, but he is tackled immediately around the two-yard line. Mark it on the three. May not have been the best idea to uh, try and grab that ball up, David, at that time. Yeah, well, I don't think it was going to go in the end zone. I don't need it. I think it was going to go out of bounds, yeah. but still, I think I'd have took my chances. Yeah. It's one of them things when you're down there in a situation like that, you want to get the it's, it's, you it's react. A, yeah, it's a reaction. Hey. Yeah. And the thing is, Fita had a block. He had a lane. He did. He did have a lane there. All right, it's 31-6 to six here in the third quarter. 46 seconds left on this clock. The Pirates have got them pinned back around the three-yard line. Let's see if the defense can get some penetration here on this huge offensive line for the Terriers. They're going to line up in a bunch, and they're going to run the ball at us. And they did, too. They did. We stack him up. They push him back. I don't know if he made the line of gain. I maybe give him a half yard, David. That's what it looks like. You can see a little bit better than I can from this angle. I want to thank our sponsors tonight. Uh, really appreciate you folks uh, allowing us to bring this to our community, and, and especially the folks down at Moorhaven tonight that couldn't make the trip up. I uh, appreciate you folks joining us. We know you're on YouTube with us. We appreciate that. Uh, appreciate y'all being here with us. Guys, we're fixing to go into the fourth quarter. We're going to take a break with our Pirates. They're leading 31-6 to six here on your Village Pizza scoreboard, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, Family Nurse Practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Guys, we're back. Uh, we had a false start there on, I think it was on Moorhaven. One of the linemen jumped. Going to make it half the distance to the goal. Going to make it second and about 12. The number 52 was in the game just come out. All right, they're bunching it up again, David. See if we're going to go after him. And uh, – he squirted out there for Man, a yard they pushed or two. pretty hard, David. Yeah. Gain of about a hard two yards for them. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of a safety net. Brings up third and nine for the Terriers. And that's number one uh, on the carry, Daquan Adderley. All right, Pirate fans, get behind your defense and make some noise. It's third down. All right, Moorhaven stacked up. 
direct snap. Oh, and we may get him in the backfield. No, I think he's – I think it was maybe the – well, maybe he'd be in a safety. No he's call right on yet. It. I don't know. It's it looks like they're going to mark it, on, it the on, one, on the one. Or the half-yard line, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, it was on the half-yard yeah, line. I think, his, I think his forward progress was Yeah, that was a dangerous play for them. 31-6, your Pirates lead on the Village Pizza scoreboard. I got tongue-tied again there, David. <laughs> 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 it's hard to say sometimes. That's what he sounded like when he was eating that egg roll at the Chinese place yesterday. Man, you don't know it. <laughs> it was good stuff. All right, they got another player coming in late here. They are uh, in a punting formation. Camden Hickox, Code Red's back. And, oh, another and the whistle blue flag down, false start. They're going to be half of a half a yard. So As keeps up. They're going to kick out the church parking lot. <laughs> it's going to be on the uh, half inch yard line. Yep. <laughs> So our young man is back that uh, did get down earlier in the injury, yep. back kicking again. Hickox is on our 30. And he's he's going to take a knee. He's going to take the safety. safety. It wasn't going to give him a chance yeah. to uh, take it and, and run it home. Yeah, so that was, that was kind of a that, smart that idea, was, David. That was, smart. that was a very smart idea. It's going to make it 33-6. Your Pirates just score on a safety by the punter. They'll have to kick off to us here. Should be. Uh, David, I want to give a big shout out again to, uh, to uh, folks here in Apple County and surrounding counties that are watching tonight. Uh, there is a crusade coming. It starts uh, September 17th here Sunday night at Jimmy Swain Stadium, uh, 482 Blackshear Highway. It's Go Tell America with Rick Cage. Uh, if you want to go to the website and know a little bit more about it, it's www.gotellcrusades.com. Yes. Um, it's one of the uh, – Small town Billy Graham. Um, this this is a free crusade. Yes, free. It'll be happening up to around Wednesday, I think it's the last. It is the 20th. It'll be and, the last uh, time. Right here at Jimmy Swain Stadium come. People from all around's coming. Um, it's going to be a great time. Starts at 7 o'clock. Here at Jimmy Swain Jimmy Stadium Swain here Stadium. in Appling County. There's there's good parking. So, if you, you've yes. got handicap, there is handicap parking too. So, They'll you be, know. People here to assist in any way you need. That's right. And, and, and it's going to be a, a good time. That's right. Come and join them, folks. Uh, it's a good time to, to, you know, to talk about Jesus. I'm not that, afraid to say it, that myself. Man. So, uh, I mean, um, we'll good be fellowship. Here. <laughs> I know I'll be here. Yes, and, sir. Uh, so Looking yeah. forward to it. This is what they basically call a free kick from the 20 yard line for the Pirates. Taking the safety while ago was kind of a smart idea for Moorhaven. Yep. Don't give up as many yards. Oh, he's going to try an onside. Right. And it's going to roll around. We pick oh, it we up. pick it up. Who's got it? That's, That's Williams. Ed, Williams. Ed Williams. Going around the edge, puts his head down. What a job by Ed Williams. He goes out about the 31-yard line. Still gives us great position with an extra two points. So It's a big-body kid, and when he's running downhill, it's even – that was a great job by Iron Man there. Yep. All right, Pirates take over on the 31-yard line. We've got 10-13 uh, left here in the fourth quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We got Trent Griner in the backfield. You got split wide, uh, one to the left, one to the right. Uh -huh. Kellen and, and uh, Camden. I'm going to say hello, Latrell Salem watching us tonight. Glad to have you with us. All the folks viewing us here tonight, we really appreciate it. We'd love to hear your comments on how well we do or how bad we do. Well, There's how bad David do. Oh, Griner. He's still on his feet. Yep, they finally wrestle him down. That number three for them, Zaylin Jackson. He's all over the place, man. Running back, linebacker, doing it all for, for Moorhaven. Miss Griner's watching. Um, Way to go, Trent. Garrett Griner. And if there's any bad comments, make sure they're about David, not me. <laughs> I have feelings. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> hey, and David's old. He can't read them anyway, so I'll just read them to him if he's got I my name I told you, in. I got new glasses. I'm good now. 
Hey, love you, brother. Enjoy it, man. I appreciate you being here with me, and I appreciate Jamie Gardner and the Backs News. I was banner. looking down the highway there. It goes pizza delivery. Are they coming to you? N- not yet. All Getting right, close. Pirates. Wait oh. for the snap and had a man in motion in. on the line there, David. Uh, when he went in motion, one of our linemen jumped. Yep. I actually could see that from up here with these new spectacles. <laughs> you know, I hadn't really messed with you too bad. You know tonight. what? The thing is, I'm glad you got your eyesight fixed, but just don't get your wife's eyesight fixed. Who? That, your wife, because her eyes get fixed, you're through. You didn't know? No. You didn't. I, you got to. You're making that deal with the. She wears sunglasses at night. <laughs> oh my God. Poor Mandy. Yes, sir. Second and one for the Pirates. There's a snap. Hand off to Griner. Right up the middle. Oh, and he, oh, he runs across one. one. Still, still on his on feet. His feet. It makes it first and goal for the Pirates. Takes it all the way inside the five-yard line. <laughs> Red Stone's helmet comes off. He's blocking way across over. I think that young man's been on red all night tonight. And <laughs> looks like he got the best of him that time. Looks like 54 is coming in for the Pirates to take Red's place. And Elijah Carter, the sophomore. Actually, no, I'm sorry. They, they uh, put him in and moved Leggett into center. Yep. Put him over there, right uh, tackle. Griner still in the backfield with Griffiths. There's a snap. Hands off to Griner up the middle. And Dodge. it's no, touchdown, he go around the end. It, Pirates. it was Griffiths. <laughs> he faked Griffiths you out. kept it bootleg to the right. He what? had to be fooled. Not, don't take much for David, but that's a touchdown uh, Pirates. I guess so. That was, man. 39-6, your Pirates lead here in the fourth quarter. 8.29 on the clock. Getting here for the extra point. We got a man down, folks. We're going to take a break with this one, and we'll be right back, Pirates. Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get in the back and let's do it. Do it. Appling County Pirate fans, we just come off a of score. Dason Griffiths with a fake out on everybody. Yep. And scores for the Pirates and makes it 39-6. Alan Ramirez for the extra point. And snaps snap up. The hole. The kick is up. Wow. Over the net. Into the uh, road. Watch out, car. But did you we, see number 10 come flying in there? He did, He man, was close. He was close. That makes it 46, 40 to 6 for your Pirates against the Moorhaven Terriers. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. We insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Welcome back, Pirate fans. Alan Ramirez up to kick. We've still got players coming on for Moorhaven. There he is. Uh, 8.30 left on the clock here in the fourth quarter. Your Pirates lead 40-6 to six against a quality Moorhaven team here, David. Yes. 
Score does not say what this uh, pooch kick. No fair fielding. At the 25, we're chasing him backwards. Oh, my he's goodness. Got some he's got room. He's going around that right side. He's got the kicker to beat. He's still – somebody caught him from behind. Wow, what a run by Moorhaven. And that was number 16 for the Pirates. Jamarcus Robinson from running him from behind. Not before a heck of a gain by that young man. man. He goes out and gets tackled around the 37-yard right, yard line of the Pirates. <laughs> yard, Ryan. I can't yard, 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 yard. I have been hanging around you too long. Yard, 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 <laughs> yard. It's all David's fault. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. He's speaking, speaking, speaking the gibberish. Yeah, it is bad. All right, first and 10 for the Terriers from the 37-yard line. David, take it away if you're still awake. I'm Old still man. here. More Haven. Uh, Two backs in the backfield with him. Snap. Hands off to the running back. Oh, he is middle. stuffed in the middle. Yeah, I think he may have got a yard. They've got him spotted around two yards, but let's see. Well, we got Keyshawn Walker with us tonight. Good deal, old pirate. Yep. Great athlete. Oh, yeah. Hope he's doing well. Second and nine now. Did he give him a gain of a yard, David? Another pirate watching us, Ben Griffiths. I've heard of him. Who's he? Didn't he play something once before? He was baseball. He badminton or something. Was, yeah, 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 badminton. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Second and nine for the Terriers here. Being a good kid. Yes, sir. Great young man. Love him to death. There's that big back in the backfield again. They got a man coming on. Two backs. They're set, and he wasn't ready, so they lay a game. Oh, they got timeout before the, yeah, the clock runs. Yeah, run they out. got their last timeout in, David. Going to make it second and nine. Uh, we're going to stay here with them, Cole. We're going to take a break with them, guys. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, Pirate fans, we're back. Moorhaven's got it second and nine. They're coming off the third time out of this half. Got some new names out here. Cree Brutons, I see's out. Uh, looking yep. over their way. He stakes. Oh, there's a pass. Got him. Oh, and it's almost, almost intercepted. He overthrew wow. his man. Grayson Hall just off the fingertips. He had a step on that young man. Grayson's wanting it back now. Chris Ulias, Kira Griner says Trent's birthday is Tuesday. Happy birthday, Trent Griner, the bull. Yes. What's 17 going on 100? No, nah, he's, he's 12. He's going to play 12 U rec ball with us. <laughs> now I'm going to recruit him. <laughs> All right, that makes it third and nine for the Terriers here. Third down. Third and nine. See what more Haven can dial up here. Quarterback takes the snap. He's looking. He fakes the handoff, drops back. He's wanting to throw. But oh, and they push him out of bounds around the 42-yard yep. line. Lost a few yards. Maybe both players are okay. Didn't like it go far out of bounds there. No. That was uh, none other than 55. Your bulldozer, Jalen Bennett, with the push out. Knows your secondary done their job there, David. Not a man open for him to throw to. Young man is very elusive there. You know Moorhaven's going to try and go for it here. It's fourth and 14. Scores 40 to 6. Your Pirates lead here in the fourth quarter with 5-16 on the clock. You know what, Chris, I'd like to say, you know, a big shout-out to that number 15, to Keem Paisler, freshman who has stepped in this quarterback role to bring this team down here. To man, he's done an awesome here. job, and yes, sir. He's really done a good job. This, this man's got a great future ahead of him. Steps back, look, 
Go throws, he's got a man back throws shoulder it. just too far over. Yes, sir, just out of bounds. The Pirates will take over on the 42-yard line. And I do want to say that, David, again, that young man has accepted a role that was not his coming down here. I believe right. they said one of their players, uh, I don't know what happened. I still yeah. don't know. I won't, I won't say anything because I don't know. But yeah. stepping up and doing the job that needs to be, it's always to make next man up. You That's know what right. I'm saying? So, you know. And a now, lot of weight on his shoulders, but I think he's sir, done a fine job. He's going to take them far down there in Florida sure in, that, in that region and what they're in. Kid is a freshman. We got a load of uh, second teamers in here, David, and I want to make sure we call some names and numbers out. Who is that in the backfield? They're fixing to run hammer. Direct, yeah, direct snap. I hope these boys are ready for this because this JV team. That is Kamani Riles, ain't it? I believe so. This JV team took it to Brunswick yesterday. All they wanted to handle. They come away with a loss, 20 to 14, but um, that's Darion Hood. Oh, David. Darion Hood. Okay, I couldn't tell. They got a flag on them. It looks like they were offside. Look at here. Shane Gillis is out there. Uh, Gillywagon. <laughs> we were trying to you. figure out a nickname. Uh, we, I love, still have I love, love that me young. some Shane. Yes, love all these young men. I mean, just great job. This is a testament to what the Pirates are doing. Direct oh, snap. he's got some room over here. Morehaven pushes him out he of bounds. Close to a first. No, he stayed up. That may be a first down for yeah. the Pirates. Now I got number 20. That's Nate Davis. Yes. That's Nate I had that wrong. Now here comes in 21, Darion Hood. Great job by Nate Davis. All right, first down for the Pirates. 4.35 on the clock. See what Darion can do here out of the hammer. High snap. Takes it. Looking to the left side. Running in behind them backs. A gain of four. I'm trying to see some names. Whitman Tires out there, number 65, and number 54 for the Pirates. Elijah Carter. Christian Hood was just out there. Number 42 for the Pirates. Uh, Devontae Poole. Got Man, number. just a host of new faces out here. Love, love, love. 72. Who we got Braxton on this far McNeil. Side? I can't tell. Was that 38? John Carter. Oh, look Hopefully at the running run. room here. Tackled from behind. I think that was number 27 for the Pirates. That's Jaden Miller. Miller. Good run by Jaden Miller. Close to a first down for the Pirates. Very close. Got 82 out here. Dalton Cerro. Man, all kind of new faces. 77, Carson yeah. Lara. Number seven coming in, Adrian Williams. Adrian Williams going to take the snap. Snap. Looking running room just right side. He's got a lane. Got a blocker still on his feet. One block and he's gone. Yes. But that's a first down, Pirates. Great job by Adrian. Good blocking over there on that right side. Sure was. First down. I'm missing some numbers here, David. Who's playing center there? Is that, is that Mr. Tire? Yep, that's uh, Whitman Tire, 72, if I've said his name, Braxton Miller. McNeil, excuse me. Johnson with the That's snap. number 28. Uh, Javez Johnson. 28. Number 39 is coming in, Christian Hood. They moving people in and out yes, real sir. fast. Giving them a chance. That's what they deserve. They're Shame. out here practicing just as hard as that. Uh, was coming back out. Varsity team. They run them in so quick. Nate Davis is in. Yeah. Davis is back in. Number thirty-three. I haven't called his. As Avius Lane. There's a snap. Looking for some room. Oh, he's, he's got some room. Feet. Bouncing off of people. And the whistle blows. Ball's going to be dead on the 29. Yeah. I think that's what they got him, 29 yeah. yards. So, it's going to bring up third and about five for the Pirates. Great job by that line. Number 66 is in, David. Landon Roberts. Number 70. 
DeAndre Mims. Man, just fresh. a host of upcoming Pirates coming in here, David. Love, Ooh, love, Mims love a it. a big body kid. Look at him. He's a good-looking young man, too. Yes, sir. Man, I love to see this. There's Hood in the backfield taking the direction. Tell out. you what, these young men, Hammer. they are a scrappy Takes bunch, a too. Snap right, right up, up the middle. Oh, he's oh, spinning off people, still on his feet. That's a first down, Pirates. You're number 21, Darion Hood, for a first down. Future looks good. Man, I love it, David. That's what you want to see. Yes, sir. Clock's running. Do they give them another play, David? They should be able to at least play another play. These yeah. kids deserve to play it out. They sure do. You don't stop playing. Adrian Williams take the snap. There's a snap. He's looking that left side, looking for a block. He's trying to get around. He's got some he room got past over there. One or two of them. They, they stack him up right there. He broke he loose, but I think the whistle blew. I believe you're right, David. This going to bring up first, uh, excuse me, second in about seven for the Pirates. Can they get another play in here with 25 Clock. seconds here? Clock's ticking down. We're trying to get people in and off the field so we can get something happening here. Got to get the ball down and snapped. 20 seconds and counting. There's the snap. Probably going to be looking for Shane oh, Gillis in the corner. A wobbly pass. Gillis is coming back to it. Oh, oh my. <laughs> he done the right thing. The ball was thrown a little high there. Shane wobbly just knocked pass. it down. All right, your Pirates win here 40-6 to six against Moorhaven here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We want to say thank you to all our sponsors tonight for everything they do to allow us to bring this to Appling County and the, and the surrounding counties. And, uh, David, what a game. What that, a ball game. For real. I, I am I'm amazed at this game. I, and, and, guys, you're going to see what you see right now as the kids go through and shake hands. And, you know, this is what I like the most, the camaraderie between, between the uh, teams. And, uh, you know, that's the way it should be. Folks, yep. we're going to take a break. We're going to give it just a second and get you the play of the game. Oh, you're well, ready? We're going to stay with it. We're going to stay with it and close with this. Uh, we've already got the play of the game that we always like to do. And once we get through with this, guys, we're going to call it a night uh, for us. Am I right, Cole? Yeah, we're let me say something before we go to it. Let's say Jason Bennett says, thank you, 55, for the performance on my birthday. Happy birthday, Mr. Bennett. Hey, yes, sir. Great job. All right, folks at home, this is something we always love to do. We like to do the play of the game. And uh, Mr. Producer, uh, do you want to give it to us? Okay. Okay. All right, here we go, folks, here at home. Right. There's the snap. There's the run. Trent Griner. Look at the blocking for Griner. Man, the that offense. Him loose. That offensive line just cleared out a hole for him and just blocking all the way down and sprung him loose for the touchdown. And that is your play. That's a of the team game. effort right there. That made sure that is. play uh, do what it does. And what you see on the screen right now, guys, is our Pirates paying tribute to the band. They love their band. They love their cheerleaders. This is a spectacular show of uh, of. Uh, I, what do you want to call this, man? Just. Uh, School spirit. That's yep. something that's been lost for a while. We need to get the school spirit back up here. We need our kids to come out and be loud and proud, which you do have a student section. I'm going to recommend moving them right here in the front, down at the bottom. I would love it. I would love it. Now, right there. Right in the very front. It's always clear because they worry about something being in their way, but them kids could get those other kids excited yep. more at the middle of this field than they can down there on the corner. So I'm going to recommend that. But, guys, we're going to call it a night for us, and we're going to go to commercial break, and we're going to call it a night. We're proud of our Pirates come off of a 40-6 to six, uh, victory against a strong team out of Moorhaven, out of Florida. And uh, the Terriers uh, look forward to comments and going back and looking at those tomorrow, guys, and we appreciate everything you do. As I always like to say, go Pirates, David. And, hey, same thing, go Pirates, and uh, y'all be here, uh, the Crusade. That's right. Is – uh, the crusade starts um, Sunday night right here at Jimmy Swain Stadium, 7 o'clock. Um, it's a great time. I'm looking at Pastor <laughs> uh, Jordan Ball right here. He knows all about it, too. Um, 
Yeah, we do want to make sure that y'all folks talk about the crusade. You know, that y'all uh-huh. are here for the crusade. It's going to be a great thing. Uh, you know, a good time to worship and and proud of what they're doing yes. here and being able to bring it to the communities around uh, Appling County also. Uh, we don't care what community you're from. We don't uh, care if you're a pirate, you're a jacket. We don't, don't care. care what you are. Come on. We Everybody, all, we we're all, all the support the good Lord. So. That's right. All right, guys, go Pirates. Great victory for the Pirates tonight. David, your usual? Uh, my usual. Um, beam me up, Cole. <laughs> <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you football is all about teamwork every player does his job every player is on the same page and the team never quits never never we follow the same playbook at woody Folsom auto group in baxley and are proud to support the appling county pirates better get the back and let's do it do it tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or 